You think Katie is going to go in the Chase Center and going to beat Steph? Yes. You think that's going to happen? Yes. If, if, oh, if, if my he's God. with the Celtics. No way. Of course, if he's with the Celtics, no yes. Way. He's good, who, good players. Who on Toronto's roster will the Brooklyn Nets want? Who? Oh, okay. I, I'm going to name the piece. <laughs> yeah, see? Go no, ahead. I'm going to name the piece. You're going to be shocked. I'm laughing because you're going to be shocked, okay? okay. It's going to be Scotty. Oh, they have Scotty Barnes, the guy that everyone's losing their mind about. I don't know why. But everyone, but they think he's good. And then um, they have a, <laughs> they have a Gary Trent. Who? <laughs> a guy who can make threes. That's got three. Points. And then they have tons of draft picks. Okay. No. Yeah. This is former Chicago Bear Desmond Clark. And y'all hear me on many podcasts, but when y'all hear me on Pick'em Pros, y'all know it's all about family. This ain't just business. Everything's going my way. We're coming back tonight. We're coming back tonight. We're going to tie it up 2-2, go back to Golden State, then 3-2, three, three, then we're going to control the series. Gentlemen, welcome back. You know who it is. I am Derek Thompson. And I'm Diego Thompson. And who are we? We're the Pick'em Pros. We're the Pick'em Pros coming back at you in the house. Again, father and son dynamic duo picking the latest games, although there's not much to pick right now. So we are talking NBA free agency. Where will KD go? Uh, we've been making our NFL list, both fantasy and ranking the top teams. But today... We are just getting a quick post in before we get out and play golf tomorrow. We want to talk about where will KD land? So let's go ahead and get into it really quickly. We talked about it on July 4th when uh, he requested a trade. We made some predictions, but let's talk about where he's going to land. And as far as the Boston Celtics, did they make the right move by reaching out and initiating trade talk? So let, let's have you take it away, man. Yeah. Yo, know, I mean, Boston, you know, Boston, they already had a good team. They made the finals. Um, their two best players, the All-Stars, under 25. So they could have, so they could have had great things ahead. But, yeah. yeah, yeah, but now I feel like they're the team that needs to make this deal the most because they, because they already reached out and, and, and J, and they, and the Jalen Brown stuff leaked. So now he, and I don't think he's too happy about that. No. So, uh, yeah, so if they don't, yeah, so if they don't make the deal, then Jalen Brown's going to be unhappy and might not want to play there anymore. Right. But then if they do, uh, they might, they might get a championship. But but then I don't know if KD's going to stay healthy. Um, it might only last a couple years, maybe t two or three years. Yeah. So, yes, I just don't think this is good at all. Yeah, I don't Boston. think it's as somebody that picked. The Boston Celtics to win next year. I again, when I first heard the news, I was devastated by this because <laughs> I really felt strongly that Boston Celtics are going to win next year anyway by the moves that they made, by getting Gallinari, by getting Brogdon. They were set and it was set for years to come. And now I feel like they've put all that in jeopardy. Yes, if they get KD this year, they will probably definitely win the championship, but Whoa. for his long term, yeah, okay. Well, they will get a. They they might possibly could get uh, not next year, man. That's the Warriors, man. They're going for back to back. So you're no saying, way. hold on. So you're saying if the Boston Celtics get KD, okay. You think KD is going to go into Chase Center and going to beat Steph? Yes. You think that's going to happen? Yes. If, oh, if, if he's God. with the Celtics? No way. Of course. If he's with the Celtics, no yes. Way. He's going to be a shell of himself. Man, you're crazy. He's going to be a shell. And, no. and, and, and then you know who's no. going to have to lead? You know no. who's going to have to lead? Tatum. <laughs> oh, wow. The guy you no. faded in the biggest no. series. Tatum, we'll get Tatum later. Tatum's going to be just fine. But no, again, 
if they if the Celtics get KD for the the current trade that was was proposed, um, yes, I feel that they would definitely win the title. But I think they're going to win the title anyway. So you don't have to bring in KD. You're shortening your title run if you get rid of Brown. You need to keep Brown. Um, you've already made the picks. The the you already made the right moves in the off season to be good for a long time. So I feel that they'll definitely win next year and have a long run. Now, if the trade doesn't go through, like you said, Brown is impacted. Is he going to want to stay when his two years are up? Um, and if they do make the move again, I think they'll win a title right away, but I believe their span of uh, titles that they can win will be less. So I don't like the fact that word even got out that they proposed this trade um, because I don't see anything better coming out of this than what they are, the situation that they already had set up. So I was devastated by I feel a little better now. I've calmed down a bit. So it's a good thing we did not talk about this a couple of days ago, <laughs> but I was totally devastated by it. So, yeah. yeah. Phil, because yeah. you said that um, KD was going to go to the Pelicans. Mm -hmm. Do you still feel that? Because I, I haven't heard anything about the Pelicans going after KD. Exactly. And that's the thing you got to be worried about. Mm. You know, mm. so yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. So, um, Phoenix, my Phoenix, Miami, the Warriors, which you said were gonna get him, mm -hmm. and, and the will. Toronto Raptors, who could have maybe made a deal, but um, hey, they were they were in trade talks, so they have stuff to offer. Toronto does not have anything, to they offer. do. They, have, if you look at their roster, they have good, they have, they have who, good players. Who on Toronto's roster will the Brooklyn Nets want? Ooh. Oh, okay. I, I'm a name's a piece. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, see? Go no, ahead. I'm a name's a piece. You're going to be shocked. I'm laughing because you're going to be shocked, okay? They have Fred Van Vliet, who was an all star last year. He was an all star, okay? He was an all star. How tall was Van Vliet? I, I don't know. Like, he's in the okay, six foot. Okay. But anyway. Katie for um, Van Vliet. All right. No, uh, no, not just Van Vliet. Okay. It's going to be Scotty. Oh, they have Scotty Barnes. The guy that everyone's losing their mind about. I don't know why. But everyone, but they think he's good. And then um, they have. A, <laughs> they have Gary Trent. Who? <laughs> a guy who can make threes. That's got three. But, and then they have tons of draft picks. Okay. No. Siakam, <laughs> you know, um, uh, other players, you know. If, if, mm. Wow, yeah, that that would be the highest. Of <laughs> okay, the okay, that but but the the, <laughs> the Nets were willing to make deals if they were going to put Barnes in there, but okay. the, but the Raptors didn't want to give up Scotty Barnes yeah. for Kevin Durant, I'm, so. I'm, I'm gonna have to. I, I'm gonna have to watch some more film on Scotty Barnes because yeah, I, I didn't see. I mean, hey, good player, but mm. my goodness, this is he's. He, yeah. <laughs> but um, anyway, um, right. so this so, uh, those four teams are out of it. Mm -hmm. But you haven't heard it yet. The 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 Pelicans are not out of it. They so it's really just between them and the Celtics, okay. and they have they have Ingram. Brandon Ingram, who's mm -hmm. a, who's an all star, yeah. all star. He can, and he can make all star for mm -hmm. he can make tons of all stars for his career. Okay, he's he's still I don't know somewhere around twenty five, twenty six. Okay, so yes, yeah, so you, you can have lots of great years with him. And then they have role players, lots of role players on the team, and dra and tons of draft picks for mm -hmm. like the next ten years. So so I, so you think if if the Pelicans make a move for KD, you think they would get rid of Ingram? Instead of Zion, you think Ingram's the guy that, that will go? Yo, they can't. I don't think they really can get rid of Zion because oh, because they signed. Yeah, because yeah. they just just signed. Mm -hmm. and I, I, I don't know really. Yeah, I, don't know. I, I don't really know might, how that works. Might but... have to wait till uh, the new year for that. I'm yeah. not, not yeah, sure. Yeah, and then that. Zion, okay. you know, he he, he he might be better than Kevin Durant next year. You never know. But it, if he stays healthy, it's, it's a possibility. Mm. Hey, last time he played, he was. All star starter. I love him when he plays, but ooh, better than KD. I'm saying if May, did you yeah, not hear me when okay, you said right. if he stays healthy? All right, all right, all right. You know, he, you, healthy, he huh? might not, but but know. if he stays healthy. Okay, okay, okay. All yes. Right. Well, hey, I again. So okay, so you're you're holding on to the Pelicans. Yes. That on. would come out of nowhere to a lot of people because we haven't heard anything about that. Um, you know, again, 
I, I'm still not closing the door on the Warriors. Getting they on. closed I, the door. I know what they said, but I don't. I, I'm telling you, they, they they will sneak in at the last minute and shock the world. They did it before. First of all, they messed their team up for years to come. How they mess up their team for years to come? They just won the championship. Well, okay, they might. They're, they're probably going to win a couple more championships that happens. Mm -hmm. But then they use all of their young players and all of their draft picks and maybe Draymond if it if that's the closer. Mm -hmm. No, nah, they can't include Draymond. Draymond's the glue. The glue oh, and yeah. the guts to the world. Oh, man. yeah. The glue, heart and soul. Mm -hmm. But anyway. You know. All right, so the consensus is still that he is going to stay with the Nets. Okay, so that's what most people say. I guess you're betting on it. Mm, those are prob probably the best odds since uh, a trade hasn't happened. This uh, happen hasn't happened yet, but I don't know. I, I still can't see KD starting camp in Brooklyn. Yeah. I still think he's going to go somewhere. So Yeah, and less uh, likely that I'll They'll finish the year. There. I don't yeah, think yeah. Going. Okay. So you are sticking with your pick that he will mm -hmm. uh, go yep. to the Pelicans. Silence. I'm Ooh, sticking silence. with the fact that he's going to go to the Warriors. I'm not coming off of that. We're sticking with <sighs> our initial predictions. Oh so we will see what happens there. But before we get out of here, you know, we just wanted to post real quick today. Um, we have 18 holes of golf. You and I tomorrow. Oh, yeah. Where, yeah. Uh, again, oh. you... Played pretty well last time with nine oh, yeah. holes, but anybody can play well, hit some lucky shots, nine holes. Lucky. Can you do it for 18 holes? I did you have it never beaten me in 18 holes of golf. Okay. Are you going to be able to do it tomorrow? Uh, well, oh, well, first of all, I shot like 15 shots better than you. Um, but when holes. we only played nine, do you think you were going to come back? That's how you play that hole right there. Yeah back from that uh, from that I? devastating de <laughs> it's I'll like come back. I'll come after back one shot on like the eight you just you just quit i've come you're back just like, before done. I've, done. I've come back before and chased yeah. you down well, i've done it before, Not even I've, done it before. Yep. I've, I've done yeah. it plenty of times yeah. they call like me mr that? 17 no way. No they call way. Mr. 17 18 because uh, on no the 17th and 18th no hole oh man clutch city so we will see no what happens tomorrow so while we're playing golf tomorrow we are going to go through the entire nfc uh and make our divisional picks and give you our playoff picks so that'll be coming out in a couple of days so that's going to be a lot of fun fun day of golf mm -hmm. and we'll uh talk a little football but um hey man let's get some rest get ready because we got oh, a big yeah. day tomorrow of golf but uh thank you for all the comments again let us know where is kd going to end up let us know and also tell us who's going to win the championship next year. So those are two Oof. things that we want to know. Thank you for all the love and support. We can't wait until the fall when we really kick this thing off and officially launch our show full-fledged. But until then, enjoy sports. Enjoy um, enjoy each other. Enjoy life. We'll see y'all next time. Pick them pros. pros. We are out. Pros. Later. Jordan.